Um, girl you sure this will work? Yeah silly. No one's literally going to find out we are doing this right now. But it's pretty weird that you're just dyeing my hair purple. <laughs> Fuck! I'm dead. That's crazy work. But anyways. What were you and Anthony even doing in the bathroom in the first place? Minding our business. Really? Because I see you dyed his hair purple, and he's now apparently had a heart attack and he died. So I'm guessing you'll take him to the hospital, or we will be seeing him in the next episode? Well, I guess we could take him to the hospital. So you'll be the one taking him to the hospital. Or, I have a better idea. Oh my god Morty. This is disturbing to cut his hair and put makeup on and literally no clothes on. It's not disturbing, it's called having fun and living once in your lifetime. Now we call my doc Kendrick to revive him. Why Kendrick and not calling the actual doctor? So we could avoid from going to jail. Wake up you fucking Cuban faggot. Morty what the fuck are you doing? I'm fucking trying to wake this nigga up, duh. How long is this motherfucker going to revive Anthony? No nigga, I can't revive your gay Cuban boyfriend. Why? Because I need 469,000 American dollars so I could pay my bills. Here's your fucking 469,000 dollars. Where the fuck did you get that gun? I've always stayed strapped every day on these niggas. We're going to jail now. No we're not Brianna. In fact, I have a better idea. We're going to dump two bodies off of the nearby river. Dumping my best friend and dumping your homies in the river is just outrageous. Are you going to help me dump their bodies in the river? I'll get Kendrick. You get Anthony upstairs. Okay, we here. I shouldn't be dumping bodies, Morty. Well, I am fucking saving from us from not going to jail. Now dump the bodies in the river, before I dump you in the river also myself. Three, two, one. Hooray! We fucking did it. Let's go, bitches. Ah, uh, that doesn't sound good. Morty, someone called the cops on us, and coincidentally, they found us in the park next to the river with bodies. What do we do now, Morty? Morty? Yo, nigga. Don't you fucking get in that car. A young boy carjacking my car. Take the keys in my car. Just get the fuck out of here before I change my mind. <laughs> Where the fuck am I? Shut the fuck up. You are dead to society in every country. It's me. Oscar Babyface. Oh hell no. Can I fucking leave? You'll make more money if you do my dirty work. So, here's what we got. We got suspects, Rihanna and Camila. They're out of the hospital and the police decided to not arrest them both. So this is a good opportunity to kidnap them. What? You heard me. I want you to kidnap them and bring them to me. And you'll also get paid but. They'll be laundered in our washing machine, and to our buyer and send back to us, and your payment will be here tomorrow morning. Fuck it, I don't say no to money. So where is the two girls at? I've managed to get their locations on their phones. One of them is the park, and one of them is in a restaurant. Okay, I'm here where this girl at. Hey, maybe they're in this restaurant. I'm going to disguise myself as a chef. So maybe if I poison her, then she'll pass out, and I'll take her and put it into my trunk. You guys like my disguise? Oh shit, I gotta change my voice to make it seem like I'm an adult. <coughs> How do I sound? Perfect. I found this rat poison in one of the cabinets. I shall save it for her favorite food. Hey excuse me madam, want some food? Just give me rice chicken please. Time to poison this bitch. Wait! What? You forgot the special ingredients. Boogers and cum. Okay, go ahead. I'm... Oh, oh yeah. oh. Coming! <laughs> Here you go mom. Enjoy your food. Thanks. God, I fucking don't feel good. I need to throw up somewhere. Um, excuse- And fuck. That took way too long. Now let me grab her and tie her up and bring her to my trunk of my car.
Who the fuck is that? Excuse me, young lady. Binds if I sit next to you? I guess. You wanna go to my house? Um, sorry, but I just met you. Well, you know what they say. If a girl says no, then you shall knock her out and take her. Excuse me sir. Your friend brought those two girls back. Good. Let us see the girls. Great job, Morty. You got the bitches. I have a pile of cash one million in a special car for you. What? Really? Yes! Here is the keys, and get lost. Now time to enter the car. What the fuck? Freeze. Put your fucking hands up, we finally caught you. Officer. Let me go. Shut the fuck up back there. You're acting like it was my choice. I don't fucking care. Now once we get in that court, you'll find guilty or not guilty. Oh shit. Guilty! You're sentenced for life without parole. You heard the judge. Get change right fucking now. This guy is so racist. You're the one who left me with the cops. I'm just scared to just go to jail again. I need more than an apology not going to lie to you, Morty. I know, we escape prison tonight. That's risky, Morty. I mean, it is. This is real fucking life. Dumbass, my god I am so angry at you to the point where I want to listen to your plan. First, once it's lunch time, I'll sneak in and dress myself as a cop. Second, once it's bedtime, I'll get the keys, so I could unlock the cell for you. And third, I'll bring you a cop outfit so you could smuggle your way out. Whatever happens, happens, okay? What if the plan fails? I'm not fucking around, Brianna. If it gets loud, or you get caught, start blazing. Whatever. Get some rest. I have to do some phone calls. Phone call? I managed to smuggle my phone through this prison. And I also paid someone to turn on the signal jammers. You're so very weird. Shut up, it's ringing, damn it, lady. Yo. Carlos, I need your help with some shit. I'm in prison, and you got to help me escape. What? See? Told you I'll get signals in this bitch. First off, why is Morty in fucking prison in the first place? Oh well, I'll just have me and Jeff get him out of there. Jeff, we got to save Morty. What? From where? The prison. What the fuck? Yeah, so we're going to smuggle ourselves as a cop and prisoner. Shit's getting serious already. Let's pull Morty out of his home. We're ready. You sure about this escape plan? I'm sure. I also have two pistols on me right now. How the fuck did you brought two pistols in the prison? Your money will be laundered by a buyer. Morty, this plan is going to get us killed. Get the fuck down. Everyone. Morty, this isn't the plan that you said. Shut up and grab this fucking phone. So explain to me, why are we saving Morty from prison? I don't know, but we're still saving him. Well anyways we're here. What the fuck is happening in there? I'm hearing gunshots. Quick, get your gun and put it on your waist. Hi! Jeff, are you fucking crazy? Officers and all SWATs, and all FBI agents. We have two black prisoners escaping. Hey, what are you doing? Well, what are you waiting for? Dress yourself as a cop. Hey, where are the two suspects? One of the prisoner paid me to bring two guns to them. Right now, they're in a cop outfit. Thanks for telling me, I'm impersonating as a cop, so I'll help them to escape. Oh, okay. There is no way that they're going to believe that we're actually cops. 
Yeah, as long we're doing everything right, then we'll be home safe. Why the hell are you guys dressed as cops? So we can trick the cops thinking that we are actually officers, but we're just escapees. That's not how it works, but I'm curious if it'll work. Hey, sir. Where are the two suspects? The two suspects are nowhere to be found. But we also got a blonde hair prisoner that's escaping and killing cops outside as we speak with an armored Karuma. What? Jeff is here? What? Are you part of the escape? Can we go now, you two? She's right. Let's get out of here. Get in. Where the fuck did you get this armored Karuma? I stole this from a group of angry mob Koreans. Get in now. We escape out of prison. Oh, guys, we got helicopters chasing us. There's a mini gun on top of this Karuma. Go fucking get on top and shoot. They are killing all the police. They pop my fucking tires. I'm crashing. Uh... Good job, Brianna. You killed him. Why, hello? How can I help? Can't handle the heat, my friend. Okay, leave it with Creep Uncle Lester. Take us to a hideout. I have one hideout we should go to. Wow! What a hideout. Damn fucking right, bro. Your clothes are at the table. And after that, we just chill here and pretend this never happened. Actually, me and Brianna just going to leave. There's some unfinished business we got to take care of. Um, unfinished business? Yeah! What the fuck? Huh? Breaking news. Today, there was a prison breakout on the Plotagon Count Facility Jail. We managed to get photos of the suspects. First suspect name is Brianna. She's wanted all over Plotagon City and by the FBI. If you see this person please call 911 immediately. This next suspect is unknown because we've never seen this suspect or know their name. He's also wanted from the FBI and if you see him, Please call 911 immediately. The next suspect looks familiar, but we don't know if he is actually the most wanted guy in the list. If you also see this person, please call 911 immediately. And finally, the most dangerous suspect on the list is Morty Phillips. If you especially see this man, please call 911 immediately. More news coming soon after this. Well anyways, me and Brianna will stay here for a mad while and take care of this unfinished business that we're going to pull off. I need some fucking sleep. You haven't tell me the unfinished business nigga. I'll fucking tell you when I'm done planning this heist. You need me, sir? Yes! This is a type of unfinished business I was talking about. This is it Brianna. We got to save two girls from an corrupted FBI agent. Two girls? Corrupted FBI agent? Yes! While you were in jail, some government agent kidnapped me to this guy called Oscar Babyface. We have to take him out and save the girls before he does something stupid to them. Plan stays the same. Right. You watch my back. I handled that son of a bitch Oscar Babyface. Grab a Tommy gun from the back of the drunk. Let's get in there and take him out before he does something with those two girls. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Sorry, you too. But this place is for members only. Here's your fucking membership fee. You're dead. You double chin fuck. Let's just get the hell out of here before the cops come. Oh shit. Off oh, this. Come on, Brianna. Let's get out of here. These guys are maniacs. We gotta take them down. Shit! Run! Get in the fucking getaway car. I have something to show you guys downstairs. I just fucking built a time machine. Wow! That's cool. But how the fuck is it going to help? Did you seriously fucking forget our faces all over the news? Every cop in Plotagon will literally be so fucking fooled. If they caught our clones, and then arrest them, then they'll be in prison, and they'll suffer in prison for us. And then the news will make announcement saying they caught us. But in reality, we're out here living life outside of prison. Alright Morty. Ready to see your clone? Hell fucking yes I am baby. GRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRR
perfect! You got the white nonchalant dreadhead Morty. Who the fuck is that blackie with cornrows and glasses on dancing on my fucking porch? It's Morty. Are you going to let me in or what? I was wondering when you'd show up. I had to lay low. Praise be. And you, need my help. How do you know? Cause you came here. I haven't been very civilized in life, Lester. And you're gonna make it up to me by whatever I ask can be civil. Or rather, I, I mean, I need something done, you need to know something, so, why not help each other? Yeah, well, since you put it like that. I'm getting an I find alert. That little college boy, sack of shit, phony, fuck. Narvo Gibberson? Yes! That fuck is a lying bastard, I've read his fucking emails, he's a fucking cheat. Well now it's payback time, you lying turd. The hell are you talking about? You are about to get the white collar gig that you always dreamed of, Morty. I have someone for you that'll lead you the way. He's chill but weird. Dress yourself as whatever the dress code, because you're going to have fun my friend. Hello Pookie. What the? The name's Vamp. Vamp the tech. I'm looking for a friend that's friends with Lester. Oh, that's me. You must be Morty. Hey, have you seen the prototype in the demo room? When Tony announces it at the keynote. Minds are gonna blow. Yes, I bust they my are. nuts every fucking day. Time to add a mini bomb to Tony's phone. We are so back. Hello my fellow Americans. Fuck this. This nigga is just yapping. Time to die fucker. Hello. Lester told me you're looking for your four friends. I managed to track your friends now. Here's their location. Nigga hang up on my phone like that. Oh well, I'm going to the locations. They're in some is padded cell on Colombia. We're going to Colombia. God damn it, who is this? I heard you're going to Colombia to save your friends. You can't go there just like that, silly. What do you mean? You're on the news, remember? I want to help you. Meet me and Dada's dinner tomorrow. Dress something cute. And we'll talk there. May I ask why you all dress up? Ah, uh, Morty has a girlfriend. This dick will show where's my friends are. They're in a Colombian island. Morty, you don't got a passport. And plus, aren't we still wanted from the government still? Oh don't worry about that. She's giving me a fake passports. But don't you got to wait for a little while until your clones turns themselves in. How's the clones doing? <coughs> Breaking news. We found the fugitives after weeks in Plotagon City. And lastly the fourth suspect is what we were looking for. The criminal mastermind. He's still in jail as we speak. But unfortunately that is all we have for today. You're going to a country called Colombia. But you need serious gear if you're going to Colombia. What? Why? They're being held by my father, El Rubio. El Rubio? Yes, he's my father. He's a paranoid narcissist drug lord. Your friends is in an isolation room kidnapped. Here's a picture of the area. How many guards? Over like 100 I don't know exactly. I also have some smuggling clothes for you, and a loot bag. Loot bag for what? Gold, weed, cocaine, and cash, and paintings, and that panther statue? Oh yeah. Forgot about the fake passport for you. Here, take it. I made it for myself. One thing before you go, I want you to kill my dad. I can't do that. Just do it. What do I get up? I will gladly kill your father for you. Oh and I also got someone to smuggle and stash the weapons in Colombian hunger. We're literally about to save my friends and kill me as dad. Oh well, I hope it gets me through security airport or I'll just hijack a plane. Hello! Welcome to the Plotagon City International Airport. May I please have your passport? Here you go. So your name is Sebastian Martinez, right? Yes! And this is a photo of you, yes? Very well then. Remember the plan right? Go kill my dad and save your friends and steal everything that's valuable and worth like weed, gold, cocaine, cash, and paintings and that panther statue? We're in Colombia. Um, who the fuck walking on up on me? Hey, you. What? Are you the buyer? Yes! I am. Come follow me. 
head over there. They'll bring it soon. Go on. That guy was kinda pissing me off. Wait there. What? Arms out, fuck, weapon. Hit the What the fuck? I need all bodyguards out there and fucking find this piece of shit right now. Uh, <laughs> want to fucking play? Then let's fucking play. I fucking snap the shit out of the fucking neck G R R R R Stop it right there. I fucking knew you weren't the buyer, so now you You're almost at the compound Morty. All you need to do is blow up the main gate and get your ass in there and loot up and save your friends. Wait, I'm carrying demolition charges? Yeah, silly. Just get there and place the demolition charges on the main gate and watch it fucking blow blow blow. Let's do this. Oh shit, I got to run. Knock knock, motherfuckers! <coughs> no no not again, say hi to Jesus for me. You. Where's my friends? In a padded cell downstairs. Good. Now give me all your weed, cocaine, gold, paintings and that pether statue. Oh and El Rubio. Your daughter Mia sends her regards. Alright guys, I'm about to take off. Morty, the plane signals are turning on. Are you in that plane that my cousin delivered to K.O. Perico? Yes! I am in the plane. And I am about to take off with these duffel bags and my four friends. Alright, just don't fly it over the compound. My cousin disabled the air defenses at the airstrip, but not at the compound. So whatever you do, do not fly the plane over the compound. Roger that. I have to drop these duffel bags off for someone anyways. These are all the duffel bags. Yes! Alright. Thanks, Morty. Pleasure doing business with you. What was that about? You have the most weirdest friends ever. What boundaries do you even have? Well, one. What the? Morty. Oh my god. You hit somebody. No shit dumbass I did. I'll get the body and put it on the trunk before anyone calls the cops on us. Or how about just fucking check on the person to see if they're alright. Alright. Time to, what the hell? How? What the fuck are you doing running around naked in public? Camila is trying to kill me. I'm hiding in your car. I feel naked my boobs are literally showing off. Can I tell you something? What is it? I hate you. Fuck you too then bitch. I'm going to smoke weed in this car. Oh hey look. There is Camila going crazy. Where is Rihanna? I don't know who is that, nor where she is. You know what? I shall stab you with this tattoo pen. Oh shit. Oh my god Morty. He's going to kill Camila. Shit! Let's get out of here. Morty, you're not even going to do anything? I mean she was rude to me begin with, and she kinda deserves it because she tried killing Rihanna, and she's ignorant. Here, take my fucking gun then pussy. Oh, so now you're quiet as a mouse now? Look who's sucking my dick right now as we speaking. I, I, I touched little girls. Oh my god thanks Brianna. Police? Freeze. You two are under arrest. Shit. We gotta run from them. Quick, follow me Camila to Morty's car. I'm so high. Morty. Drive, 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 drive. Damn you guys have the biggest titties. Oh great. You had to be brought this pervert along you bitch. This car smells like strong weed. Fuck this. I'm jerking off. Uh, hey. Brianna he's literally jerking off behind me, I don't feel safe, I am uncomfortable. Wake up Brianna. Wake the hell up. What's going on? I got a surprise for you. What do you, what do you think of this fucking vehicle Brianna? I stole this from a fucking police when he was smoking a cigarette and I shot him. Is this the surprise? Brianna, I had. I had. 
I had to make a fucking bomb that goes boom boom like you're shitting on the toilet. What? A bomb? And why are you serious drunk and drinking alcohol while driving? We are going to start a new fresh start. I'm going to drop it right now. You are a psychopath. Right now we're going to pick up your boyfriend, Leo. My ex-boyfriend? When I release this bomb, I'll... You know, I want you to know I care about you. Can't blow up humanity. Listen! Shut the fuck up, I get what you're saying, but you don't got to worry about my ass. If you're with Liam and all you do is rub that cooler thinking about him. Stop this fucking car, you don't even know what you're even saying. You have to worry about me getting with Liam. I don't fucking care about Liam. That's it. That's it, Morty, I'm talking the wheel. Oh shit. We're going to crash. Oh hey you're awake. Where the fuck am I? You're at the hospital. What about Brianna? She's dead. What? Well kinda dead. She broke every bones in her body, and she doesn't have medical insurance, because her parents neglected her. You need my help, to get $50,000? Yes. Okay so you heard of those two couples in Polotagon City? I have history with them. You should visit their place. Look man. Here is their address. I think I have better ideas to go to their house. You know what I'm thinking? We should finally do it. Come over here then. Fucking fuck, stop it there. What the fuck? Ah! Uh, call the police. Do not call the fucking police. If you call the police, then you and your girlfriend is dead. Alright, the first batch of cookies are done. I'm going to try one. No kid. But I'm hungry and I think we should try them before we sell them. Alright, while well you guys fight it out, I'm going to cook some more cookies. Wait, let me put it the cookies, it's my fucking turn. No, you're going to make a big mess. Ah! Uh... What the fuck? The kitchen is on fire. Run! Get him out quick. Alright Morty you focus on selling those cookies while I make the second batch of cookies. Alright Chef Marilyn, let's see. Who's trying to buy the cookies? Hey there dude, you wanna buy some cookies? They're $5,000 a piece. $5,000 for a cookie? Yeah they're really good and if you eat them they make you live forever. That's fucking sick. Okay okay I'll take the cookies. You see this toilet next to me? Yes. Morty, you fucking asshole. Ow. That's what I think about those fucking cookies. I found a solution. I just have like 10 batches of cookies ready right now. That would be really good, Morty. Alright, here's what happened. I went to the store, and I bought the cookies already made, so all I had to do was sell them. You... bought cookies? Well, technically I robbed the store as well, too. Morty, how much did the cookies cost, Morty? About $100. Where did you get the money for the cookies? I stole a few cash off of Adrian's bank account. <laughs>